Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix. I'm Black Belt Bob Man. And this is C Euro. And I don't know if you know this, but if you don't dash and you just press directions, you actually um, magnet to these little lines. Isn't that cool? Oh. It's the little touches that really make this game. So Dwarf Woodlands is the next level. It's uh, certainly a place. Spirit of the mirror, come from the far. She scared the crap out of me as a kid. Through wind and I'm not sure if I've. I'm still not I sure if I've seen thee. Snow White all the way through. You know, in the Snow White ride at Disneyland, because you know she turns into like the old hag, and there's one point where. She like pops out of a door and goes, Take a bite! <laughs> and it like scared the shit out of my sister so bad when she was a kid. Fame is thy beauty, Anyway. But who? A lovely Oh, it's that fucking mirror. She is more fair than that guy. What sort of what sort of verse is he talking? Is this iambic pentameter or He's just talking and rhyming as the road. The first, the first thing he said didn't look like it, but I wasn't paying attention. Go figure. Snow. It's like rhyming couplets, sort of. Tara is eavesdropping because he's a terrible a person. That knows and sees everything. How did he get in here? How does? How, about that? how, does, how, how did, did he get in there without jet? making that giant uh, explosion so noise that he made in the other? Beware my other queen, place. A heart of light. Another one. Heart of pure light. Wait. What if Master Xehanort is here? <gasps> Who goes there? Why does she have like these like star curtains? Did she? What eight-year-old did she beat up Tara. and rob their bedroom? I'm looking for a man named Xehanort. Master Xehanort. I thought maybe you might. Are have they seen like? Him. Are they like the glowy stars you put that on like the ceilings? No oh, I had yeah, those are cool. Me. I liked those. My sister had like a full galaxy on her ceiling. The whole room I'd, would be lit up. I had like, yeah, I had like a full solar system, oh, except yes. half the planets fell off. I, and have I a task don't know where they went. If you succeed, luckily, actually, no, the Earth the did fall off, which I thought was a bad sign. Yeah, well. And the mirror will know. Do you dare to she's, question she's me? She's funny because her her justification or her proof that she, or to back up what she says is. Don't question me! Ah! She, I guess she's sort of like Mitt Romney in that respect. Anyway, um, oh, shit. Sorry, I mean to go there. Okay, so she wants him to put Snow White in this heart-shaped box. Her heart. So and he agrees to do it. Courtney, so the queen is Courtney You're after Love, the words of like two? and then Tara is Kurt Cobain. That's how it goes, right? I guess. Light. Snow White is. Um, what did this shotgun do to you? Snow White is, is music, no and Kurt Cobain's going yours. to kill it. Get it? All right. No. Uh, I don't mind. really. My radiance is all the light this kingdom needs. <laughs> She's kind of funny, actually. And Where he's just like her? he is so not outside the castle. He's just like um, there is a blade of white. Hey. It's weird. This is the you one time I love, I love the little flourish she does to her, like cross her arms. Like every time, like in order to move, she has to uncross room. them. But then she just like this oh, Snow White is my best chance. Try to pose, her. pose for the camera. Okay, this is one of the few times Tara Zeno. shows any competence, where he's like doesn't take her shit well, or I... necessarily believe what she says. Evil fairy, yes. Evil queen, no. no does I not take shit. Happen. He's still gonna kill her though. I don't know why he's. What his fucking deal is. Or is he? I don't know. I've never played this game before. Dwarf Woodlands. Did you know they just expanded Fantasyland in uh, the Magic Kingdom in Disney World? And uh, they're adding a Snow White Gem Mine roller coaster ride? I have no idea what Fantasyland is. It's. Well, anyway, that fucking <laughs> fucking mirror is a dick, so I tried to beat him up, but it wasn't. I'll, I'll take your word for it. Uh, Disneyland is Disneyland. Sorry, Disneyland and Magic Kingdom are split up into a bunch of different quote lands: Fantasyland, Adventureland, Tomorrowland, 
Um, Critter Country. <clears throat> is this... Is this... Anaheim Disneyland or Both. Magic Kingdom in Disney World? Both. Hey guys, I got Blazaga. Oh. And second chance! That's great. Huzzah! How's that, how's that magic stat working out for you, Terra? Look, the only reason I got all these high-level magics first thing is so I could get second chance and once more, which I will have soon. I got combo F boost and finish boost, so my combo finishers and finish mo uh, commands will both do more damage. Um, second chance says that an attack that hits you when you have more than one HP will leave you at one HP, unless... But it doesn't work for combos, it only works for single attacks. And once more is the opposite, it only works for combos. Oh, I like the little apple wipe when you go between rooms. So, Terra really is a big Zelda fan, so anytime he sees pots, he has to smash them. It looks like a Zelda dungeon. Kinda does. No wonder she's- no wonder the queen is such a bitch. The castle's so boring. Wow. Well, <clears throat> she's actually secretly a bondage queen. This is her dungeon. Hmm. Does that explain the, like, jumpsuit that she's wearing? Like the- like, she's- it looks like she's wearing like a full body jumpsuit underneath her, I guess, gown? Robe? Like, next time we see her, look at her, there's like a- you know, it's, like a black, it's actually full like, leather. Cloth going over her head. It's actually and latex. Extends all the way down, skin tight her latex, neck and like down into like her cape or cloak. Okay, so those colored, um, all right, beakers. When you hit them when they're red, they explode. <gasps> it's a chest mimic. Thunder. Are chest mimics, mimics in other Kingdom Hearts games before this? Uh, I don't think so. So they drop like forty oh. gold. Innovation. They drop like 40 bucks, right? Or 40 money. So you can actually, um... Okay, so Gold Rush I unlocked. That one that I did not unlock, uh, you unlock by gaining CP from defeating enemies. Um, and then there's a couple more that I'll show off later, but... So why are you triggering those exploding jars on purpose? No, I'm not. I mean, to, I meant to show off that if they're green, they give you HP. And if, and if they're, they're blue, blue, they give you D-Link um, oh. things. D-Link, whatever the fuck they're points. So anyway, you get, and then blows up. you get 40 money for killing those guys, so you can actually farm money pretty easily right here if you just kill the Mimic over and over. Is 40 money a lot? <laughs> it's, but most guys drop like 5, so... What the hell is that noise? For me? Never mind. Oh yeah, so I wanted to show off the Cinderella D-Line. So her moves are all like, not actual commands, so Magic Mending, Enchanted Step, Wish Circle. They're actual commands, but the Start names... Start behind you, there you go. <laughs> the names are obviously names of, that they made up. So Wish Shot is actually... They're actually, I think all of her abilities are uh, abilities that are unique Take to um, Aqua. Oh what yeah, the? and it's cool. It actually, yeah, it, it makes them levitate. Isn't that cool? Oh, and <coughs> her abilities when she does, when you do her abilities, they have a lot more um, sparkle and glitter and flourish than the one when Aqua gets them. So they are actually a little bit different. And uh, a bunch of people get those types of things. Nice. So, uh, there's something I missed on the lower level here. And that was more HP balls. Oh no, I needed D-Link. D-Link prizes, that's what they're called. Yay, Blazaga. It's actually not that good. Thundaga is really good, but I won't have that for a yeah. And uh, I resolved to start uh, focusing on getting mostly physical attacks for Terra now. I just really wanted to get Blazaga as early as I could so I could get second chance. That's just how I roll. Oh, get... so second chance is automatically, I guess, equipped to, or paired with Blazaga. Alright. Right, there's groups that each... There's groups that each uh, command is a part of. 
So the group that Blazaga is in, when you put use a pulsing crystal, gives it second chance. And if huh. you use a shimmering crystal, it gives you a uh, blizzard boost or something. And if you use something. X crystal, right, ex it's l exactly. I think if you use a hungry crystal, it gives you d defender. So you'll always get the same abilities by using the same crystals with the same ability, with the same command combinations. And, ah, oh, I just missed that. Oh, is that a sequence break attempt? No, because this is just the door. I just thought maybe oh. I could jump that pit, but I could not. Time saver. Fair enough. Um. Anyway, yeah. So using the same command combination, you'll always get the same ability with the same crystal. If that makes sense. So using two Blazaras, and usually if it's something like using two Fireas to make Fireaga gives you the best abilities. Using two Blazaras to make Blazaga, even though you can make Fireaga by combining a fire with a Fira you don't get as good of abilities. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, what commands you use to make the better commands is really important. So, there's a waterfall That's here. That's fair. This is a really short room. We're already at the end of the room. But... We're missing a few things, I think. There's, like, there's don't some... Look at me. There's some stuff playing up the game. There. There's some stuff up there. I want that... Oh, yeah, there's a treasure chest up there. Did you see it? It was only there for uh, a brief second. What, did it get up and walk off? I don't know. Oh, I can't go this way. I can't jump up waterfalls, I'm not a salmon. And then, I, just, I really needed to destroy those. It was really bothering me. So if you hit this, it pulls up that little gate, but only for a few seconds. Okay. Wait, I thought these guys were immune to frontal attacks. These are like the, the fat guys from the other games. No, that's a later enemy. Later enemy, alright. No, they're like the... Not all the large bodies were immune to frontal attacks, were they? Ah, it's been it's been years since I played. Well, whatever. Okay, so... Two Kingdom Hearts games, so... When you hit this, it opens this other guy over here, and you have to be really quick, because it secretly actually also opens a second gate, which oh. leads to this secret area over here. So, that's how you get to this secret area, which I was looking at earlier, and you get some pretty good rewards, and that's where the prize pods are. Oh. That was to hide them up here. Yep, but, um, unfortunately... When you're slow, they get away, and then, they're, like I said, they're really tough to actually kill. I would imagine that if you kill them, you get much better food? No. Oh. Which is More silly. Food? Basically, no. Uh, actually, doing less damage to them is better. So I got a Nutty oh. Nut, a Gas Berry, and a Humming Mint. Hmm. What, what, what could I got, be... What I've could, got some mints right here, actually. What could I be making with all these ingredients? Yeah. And you know what? I hate this wall. Walls are dicks! Alright, but seriously. When you go... You can go back through there and there's like a treasure chest and some enemies, but I skipped all that. So now we're in this courtyard. So this courtyard has a pretty... Pretty easy to do sequence break. It's not this map. I like the treasure boxes are all floral and shit. It's cute. So, <clears throat> getting up there is actually a lot easier than it seems because uh, you can abuse geometry and uh, jump up here by actually pushing yourself um, over the uh, bush. When you push yourself towards that bush, it actually pushes you up a little bit because of geometry and the physics engine. So, it's really easy to get this Fission Fire Aga. Basically, you shoot it at an enemy and it explodes. It's a fireball and then it explodes. Um, it is one of the ingredients for Mega Flare. Mega Flare is one of the best commands in the game. Uh, not so much for Terra. Uh, oh, by the way, I'm going to do a magic trick. Shot lock. Whoa. 
Yeah, that's is a that good... actually magic, or did you know? It's that? a, it's a, it's a, it's a good trick to know because you can buy bio barrage from using metals. But why would you do that when you can get it for free? It only has a twenty percent. Actually, has a twenty percent chance, but only when you're making poison block by combining poison edge and block. But if you are Aqua, Aqua does not get poison block because she doesn't get block. So it's a lot harder for Aqua. She she can only get a five percent chance of making bio barrage. I wonder. Um, bio if barrage is the most powerful uh, projectile shot lock you can get for Terra before beating the game. So congratulations. Oh. oh hello. Who are you? Aren't you startled? I I would be. Should I be? It's true. So I think we found a character her heart is pure light. more ignorant than Terra. She's the one. Is something the matter? Does Tara's the name really bad with Xehanort work, by the way. mean anything to you? <laughs> why, why no? Well, obviously. I don't think I've ever heard that name. Is she flirting with him, no. or is she just does she just have the mentality of a small child? First. Oh. I think she's supposed to be a small child. Hey, wait! Is she? Don't go in there alone. I, I don't know. Maybe. But then the prince like makes out with her and shit. She's got to be a teenager. Whatever, we gotta kill someone first. We can't we can't follow her into the woods, but I'm sure that her running into the woods will never ever be brought up again in anybody else's story and be or be significant. Hmm. Or lead to a totally sure. bitchin' boss fight. Or a shitty escort quest, take your pick. Ugh. It gets... Why don't you show off your sweet new commands that you were just bragging about? What? Oh. Anything there? Eh, I'm getting there. There will be more command showing off later. I have Blazaga. I know you're all jelly. Oh, Meteor Shower. Here's the thing about Meteor Shower. It actually kind of sucks because it has so fucking many... Um... Oh, and, and uh, it has so many uh, shots that you have to... Um, compile, I guess, that it takes a really long time to max out, which is really bad for boss fights like uh, Iron and Prisoner. And uh, also, there are several different kinds of endings, uh, kind of fin ending moves for shot locks, I guess, um, finishers. So, um, the one that Ragnarok had, you had to time hitting circle, that one was just mashing circle. Some of them you have to spin the um, slide pad. Some of them you just hit random buttons. Lost her. Some of them. Um, she said she doesn't know anything about Master Xehanort. It's, it's weird. That leaves me with just one other option. Oh, I didn't get her heart in the box. The mirror. He really tried hard. Did put her heart in the, the box. There wasn't. I just feel. Where's he uh, carrying it? I don't know. In his shoulder. He didn't really try, to be honest with you. He didn't. He. I don't think he was planning on doing it at all. Nom nom nom, hunger crystal. Okay, so finish commands. Rising rock is like his his unique um move, but uh the gold rush you got by gaining gold. The brown ones you get by gaining CP. The red and the green we'll get to later, but that black one is actually kind of interesting. If you notice, it was at 183 before, but now it's at 190. It actually is, counts your number of steps that you take. There's an ability in this game called EXP Walker, where you get one EXP per step. Okay. So says, does what it says on the tin. So combine those two into a fun, fun grinding session where you'll just be randomly walking and gain levels. Oh, so that was Magnet. I know y'all love Magnet. Oh god. <laughs> oh. Yeah, they can do that and it poisons you. Now, is Magnet a recent acquisition? Did you buy uh, yeah, stuff made to it. get it? I made it just now. You Magnera. It just now. It's Magnera, oh. actually. But, yeah. Magnet is back 
from uh, Kingdom Hearts 2, and it's How still fucking How dare you return here, you blundering uh, Unfortunately, fool. there's no reflect, but... What are you talking about? Magnet still fucking owns. I ordered you to bring me Snow White's heart. Yeah, see, look. Like, look. Like, when a get a close on her face, to ignore. and she's wearing, like... You know, you claim to be Like radiant, a Catwoman suit. But all I without, see are shadows. Well, I, guess I told you, it's, it's, hanging it's thick vinyl. In your heart. Skin tight vinyl. You She's will pay for such insolence. <sighs> Magic mirror on the wall. God, you might be right. You know, the, the mirror only responds when you speak in rhyming couplets. <laughs> I think. Oh, the mirror. It... Alas, my liege, that I cannot do. I have no power. Yeah, he's only talking in rhyming couplets. true. So huh? then this totally you bizarre thing happens. This part makes no sense. I don't understand this. What? What did she just do? How does this make any sense? Yeah. Alright, I thought this was a good idea. No, please. Magic. Oh, this is the worst thing ever. Ooh. I kind of want to punch whoever came up with this boss battle. It's the dumbest boss battle in the game. That's right, you're fighting the magic mirror's giant face. I don't know, I think this is kinda cool. No, it's know. it sucks. It it's looks cool. stupid, it guess, if you'd like terrible things. So this is I like dumb. This, theme. this is dumb, all you gotta do is just run down this endless hallway and avoid getting shot by fireballs. Can't hit him. Just run. This sure is fun. I'm having lots of fun right now. There he is. I like it's. I don't know, I think it's kinda cool, it's kinda trippy. Oh. Uh, and then he does this shit, and it's like, get the fuck out, you motherfucker. Oh, and I have Kira already. So, if you hit him, you can sometimes stun him, but I missed. This one is one of those. Which one is different? Which one of these is not like the other? It's pretty obvious. Um. But then he stops, and you're like, hello. But if you stun him, you can get a bunch of free hits in, which is fine. <laughs> yeah, you can stun him and actually knock him down, and then you get, like, a ton of free hits. So he's actually kind of a pushover. Eh, it's early. Yo, uh... The, uh, Wheelmaster was way harder than this. Oh, couldn't no, you God. Just, couldn't you just do this world first? Oh no, Enchanted Dominion, and then you unlock this and Castle Cinderella. Yeah. Right. Okay, so he's really dumb and annoying. He's just annoying because his battle's boring as shit, and he's not even interesting. And like, look at how fucking easy that was. It's easy and boring and stupid, and I hate that boss fight so much. What a stupid boss fight. Yes, hopefully so they won't... Hopefully they won't pointlessly shoehorn it into any other character stories. <gasps> How did you escape? How did he escape? Now you will ask the I don't know. All this shit always like Where can I none find of the, nothing Tara Zeno? does make sense. Uh. Magic mirror instruct this knave. Give him the answers he doth crave. I'm telling you, he only responds to Beyond random couplets. Beyond both light and dark he dwells, where war was waged upon the fellows. Huh. I have no idea what that means. Is that But all? if you've watched the secret movie from Kingdom Hearts 2, you might have an idea. See? He only responds to rhyming couplets. Isn't that weird? Thanks. Okay. You've been a big help. <laughs> Thanks. See you later. Thanks. You told me a very cryptic message that I didn't understand. Beep boop borp. And then there's this pointless thing. Master oh, no, no, this isn't said pointless. he first received he says, word of Here's these where we're going from next. Master Yen Sid. Maybe it's time I went and spoke with him myself. I'm gonna go run off into the distance. I kind of like that design. It's got like the mining <sighs> stuff on it. I like this cutscene. It introduces my favorite character, everybody's favorite character. Woohoo! The best character. 
the character that needs all the screen time. He should have give, been given more screen time because he fucking owns. Hmm. But we'll get to that later. Mission first, complete. First, we have to go to the Mysterious Tower. If the Mysterious Tower is there, does that mean that Traverse Town is near there? Or Twilight Town, you mean? Twilight Town? I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Me neither. What? Bye.